Dr. Neuro, St. Luke's docuseries, Book 3 by Max Monroe, is the third installment in the author's romantic comedy series revolving around the doctors at St. Luke's Hospital. In this book, we are introduced to Dr. Nick Raines, a gifted and dedicated neurosurgeon who has built a successful career, but at the cost of his personal life. The story begins with Nick at the top of his professional game, renowned for his exceptional skills and adored by his patients for his compassion and dedication. Despite his professional success, Nick lives with the regret of not being there for his daughter, Lexi, during her early years. He was in the throes of his residency when Lexi was born, and his focus on his career led to a strained relationship with Lexi's mother, who subsequently moved across the country. Nick's main priority now is to rebuild his relationship with Lexi and be a present and loving father. To make up for lost time, he's taken a job at St. Luke's Hospital, which is closer to where Lexi lives with her mother. He's determined to balance his demanding job with his family commitments. Charlotte Hollis is a vibrant and charismatic woman, unafraid to speak her mind. She's an ER nurse who also works part-time as a coordinator on a documentary series called The Doctor Is In, which features the personal and professional lives of St. Luke's doctors. When she's assigned to shadow Dr. Nick Raines for the series, Charlotte and Nick's paths cross in a high-energy meeting that hints at the sparks that could fly between them. At first, Nick is not keen on the idea of participating in the documentary. He fears that he might not be able to keep his career and his renewed dedication to his daughter separate from the prying eyes of the camera crew. However, as he gets to know Charlotte, he starts to reconsider. Their chemistry is undeniable, and even though Nick hasn't ever let himself get seriously involved with anyone since Lexi's mother, he can't shake the effect Charlotte has on him. Charlotte, for her part, is initially wary about getting involved with a man who has a complicated past and seems so resolute about keeping his personal life private. However, she is also drawn to his compassion and dedication, both to his patients and his daughter. Through her work with the documentary series, she catches glimpses of the tender-hearted and loving man behind the surgeon's stern facade. As the cameras roll, Nick and Charlotte find themselves in a series of humorous and often touching situations. They navigate the quirks and antics of the hospital staff, the unpredictable events that unfold in the fast-paced atmosphere of a cutting-edge hospital, and the emotional tangle of dealing with difficult patient cases. Through it all, Nick demonstrates his brilliance as a neurosurgeon, his deep empathy for his patients, and his resolve to be a part of his daughter's life. Despite their attempts to keep things professional, Nick and Charlotte's attraction proves too powerful to ignore. They embark on a secret romance, stealing moments away from the cameras and the pressures of their jobs. Throughout this journey, Nick works to balance his newfound relationship with the commitment to his daughter. He takes steps toward forging a stronger bond with Lexi, while keeping the romance between him and Charlotte discreet. However, as their relationship progresses, it becomes more challenging to keep it hidden, especially with the intrusiveness of the documentary crew and the mounting pressures from their colleagues' curiosity. Their secret is eventually exposed, leading to a mix of reactions from the people around them. Nick is concerned about the impact it might have on his relationship with his daughter and how the public perception could affect his role as a doctor. Meanwhile, Lexi, with the wisdom of a child, who has seen her father's sacrifices, embraces Charlotte and the potential happiness she brings into their lives. Nick sees that he does not have to compartmentalize his life as strictly as he has done and that it is possible to be a loving father while also finding love for himself. In the climactic moments of the book, Nick confronts his fears and insecurities, realizing that his life can be richer and more rewarding with Charlotte in it. Charlotte sees the complexity of Nick's life and his drive to be a good father and understands that their love can only grow stronger if it encompasses all parts of their lives, including his past and his daughter. Nick and Charlotte's journey toward finding a balance between their personal desires, professional duties, and his parental responsibilities drives the narrative to a satisfying conclusion. Their relationship solidifies, becoming more open and public, while Nick grows into his role as a father to Lexi, 
and Charlotte becomes an integral part of their lives. In the end, Nick, Charlotte, and Lexi form a new, non-traditional, but loving family unit. The blending of their lives reflects the core message of the story, that love can be both an anchor and a guide through life's complexities, and that with patience and understanding, a patchwork family can provide as much warmth and support as a traditional one. With its blend of romance, humor, hospital drama, and family dynamics, Dr. Neuro brings to life the challenges and rewards of balancing a demanding career in medicine with the pursuit of personal happiness and the beauty of an unconventional family coming together. The book ends on a hopeful note, signifying that despite the trials faced by Nick and Charlotte, love and family can triumph with understanding and compassion at the core of their shared future. You can listen to the full audiobook for free by following the URL in the description.